Welcome! I'm so glad that you could make it today. Uh, my name is Jessica Settle. I am a couples counselor. I am just thrilled to be talking with you today and sharing some insights so that you can have a successful relationship that's full of happiness, full of passion, and full of a sense of just feeling well known um, with one another. The first video of my premarital series, Feeling Known. Oh, I love this topic so much. Um, and the very first aspect is getting to know one another. That is so important. So what does getting to know one another actually mean? Well, the term that the Gottman Method Couples Therapy uses is called building love maps. And that is in a way just knowing your partner's world. So here's an example a little bit. Remember when you were first dating or getting to know each other, you were attracted to each other, but you didn't really know them. You didn't really know what their favorite color was or what their hopes were, their fears, their joys. So just finding the joys of who the other person is is so, so important. What the research has shown is getting to know one another. It's not just when you first start dating it's actually a lifelong thing, a lifelong aspect of a relationship. Because if you think about it, each of you change. You're not the same person as you were when you were first dating or in the beginning of this pandemic or in the midst of this quarantine. I mean, there's so much going on in the world in each other's individual worlds. So it's so important to take that time to get to know one another. It's so important what the research has shown is that couples who succeed in life or keep that healthy relationship really know their partner's life dreams, their goals, and their passions. This is what couples are. This is who they are. Um, if you think about it, remember those good old-fashioned GPSs? those Garmin GPS's. I still have one in my car. Please don't judge me or anything. <laughs> Just in case if my phone dies on me, I have a backup. So those GPS's, you had to update them every six months or so for new construction, for new roads. It's the same way in a relationship. You have to update each other or you have to keep that curiosity um, about who your partner is and who they're becoming. And what the research has shown, when you do that, it ultimately helps your partner feel known, they feel close to you, and they feel like they're connected with you. Couples who take that time to prioritize or to keep that curiosity of who their partner is really, really buffers their relationship from external stress and conflict. The more you know and understand your partner, the easier it will be to connect in the midst of everything that's going on. And that's so important, especially in this pandemic. And so kind of to wrap up a little bit, take that time to go on a date night. Take that time to be curious about who your partner is because life is changing, your partner is changing, and if you want your relationship to succeed, take that time to prioritize your relationship, to really get to know your partner's inner world, because that is what counts. Thank you guys for taking the time to watch this video. Stay tuned to the next episode. It's going to be really great, and thanks for watching.